SUVs dominate the roadways, and for good reason. Their spacious interiors, commanding view of the road, and ample cargo space make them the preferred choice for families on the go. Recognizing this trend, manufacturers are releasing a barrage of new models to cater to the ever-growing demand. In this video, we'll showcase the most anticipated SUVs to hit the dealers in the second half of 2023 and early 2024. Before we go, please take a second to subscribe to our channel so you won't miss our future videos. Now let's go from the models arriving soon to later. 2024 Lexus TX Japanese luxury automaker Lexus is expanding its SUV lineup in North America with the 2024 TX. It's arguably a more posh version of Toyota's Grand Highlander three-row SUV, but offers more features and a distinct exterior design. The Lexus TX350 starts with a 2.4-liter turbocharged four-cylinder with 274 horsepower and 317 pound-foot of torque. Front-wheel drive is standard, and an all-wheel drive train is optional, with an 8-speed automatic gearbox. Meanwhile, the TX500H has the same gas-fed powertrain and a Direct4 hybrid setup that delivers 366 horsepower and 409 pound-foot of torque. In addition, it has a standard all-wheel drive system and a 6-speed automatic transmission. However, the cream of the crop is the Lexus TX550H+. For the first time, Lexus combines a 3.5-liter gasoline V6 with a plug-in hybrid powertrain. It has 406 horsepower and a Direct4 all-wheel drive train that unlocks 33 miles of all-electric range using a CVT gearbox. A big 14-inch infotainment display is standard on the TX, and it runs Lexus's latest infotainment interface while it sports an adult-sized third row, offering ample legroom and decent cargo space behind the third row. Lexus will build this new lineup at the Toyota plant in Indiana, making it the first Lexus machine built on that line. The new model is set to go on sale later this year, with the plug-in hybrid trim trailing behind and hitting dealers at a later date. 2024 Volkswagen Atlas and Atlas Cross Sport It's already been about six years since VW introduced its long-awaited seven-passenger 2018 Atlas SUV, followed by the more stout and sleek Atlas Cross Sport in 2020. Well, it's about that time. The pair gained some big updates for 2024. The automaker ditches the V6 in lieu of an improved and more fuel-efficient 2-liter as the sole powertrain option. The updated four-cylinder turbocharged direct-injection TSI engine makes 269 horsepower and 273 pound-foot of torque. Both the Atlas and the Atlas Cross Sport wear more modern looks with updated grills, C-shaped headlamps, and full-width tail lamps. All but the base models come with an illuminated front VW logo and a light bar that stretches across the top of the grille. New wheel designs, in sizes ranging from 18 to 21 inches, grace all four corners of the SUV. Inside both VW SUVs, the German ramped up the premium touches for 2024 with a leatherette-trimmed soft-touch dash and center console. Both models will hit the dealership around the third quarter of 2023. 2024 Hyundai Kona Hyundai's subcompact SUV enters its second generation boasting a bolder and more dynamic design, driver-centric interior. Like the previous model, the new Kona will be powered by one of two gas-fed four-cylinder engines. A 147-horsepower 2-liter is standard, but a more powerful N-Line comes with a 190-horsepower turbocharged 1.6-liter engine. An all-electric Kona is also offered. The Korean automaker is on a roll when it comes to bold design and high-tech amenities which is evidently true in this redesigned subcompact SUV. The more futuristic styling of the Kona extends to the interior, which is designed around two 12.3-inch displays on the dashboard. Available tech includes phone as key technology, over-the-air updates, a head-up display, 360-degree camera, and an 8-speaker Bose premium audio system. The new 2024 Hyundai Kona is bigger than its predecessor, and so is its starting price. The new model starts nearly $2,000 higher than before, with a base SE coming in at $25,435. Hyundai says the 2024 model will be arriving at U.S. dealerships late 2023. 2024 Lincoln Nautilus The Nautilus gets a new shell for 2024. In addition to styling updates, the two-row mid-sized luxury SUV boasts an optional hybrid drivetrain and a wide display screen that wraps around the front of the cabin. 
the base engine is a 250 horsepower, 2 liter turbocharged 4 cylinder paired with an 8 speed automatic and standard all wheel drive. The optional 310 horsepower hybrid powertrain can be ordered on all trim levels and is mated to a continuously variable transmission. Two tone paint and a blacked out trim package are optional. All of the latest active safety features come standard. 2024 Hyundai Santa Fe Gone is the old homogenous blob we've gotten so used to seeing in the automotive industry. The next generation 2024 Hyundai Santa Fe is now a blocky, square jawed, wide body mother of an SUV. Looking at the new Santa Fe from all angles, it's hard not to think about a Land Rover product. While the very horizontal front fascia with neat H pattern LED headlights has a very South Korean touch. The Santa Fe's powertrain options aren't as radically different as its appearance. In fact, they're essentially unchanged. The 2.5 liter Turbo 4 carries on with 277 horsepower and 311 pound feet of torque. It again pairs with an 8 speed dual clutch automatic transmission and front or all wheel drive. The hybrid variant, a turbocharged 1.6 liter 4 pot paired with an electric motor, will be available as well. The setup includes a 6 speed automatic and all wheel drive and is expected to make the same 226 horsepower combined. Fuel economy estimates are yet to be released by the EPA. Hyundai says the 2024 Santa Fe will reach US dealerships sometime in early 2024. While the company hasn't yet released pricing, we expect the entry-level model will start just under $40,000. 2024 Toyota Land Cruiser Toyota killed off the Land Cruiser nameplate in America back in 2021. The J200 model was too expensive, too bloated, or too dated. Fast forward to 2023, the boxy new Land Cruiser is back for the 2024 model year and it rides on an entirely modernized platform. That means hybrid power and a smaller shape. Based on Toyota's TNGA F Global Truck platform, the new Land Cruiser takes all its styling cues from past and highly popular models. Stretching at just over 193 inches long and 84 inches wide, it comes out of the box wearing 18-inch wheels, a rear-locking differential, Toyota's now well-known crawl control off-road technology, and a 2400-watt AC inverter on board. All 2024 Toyota Land Cruisers will come standard with Toyota's iForce Max hybrid drivetrain comprised of a turbocharged 2.4-liter .4 four-cylinder engine and a 48-horsepower electric motor powered by a 1.87-kilowatt-hour battery. Inside, the rugged theme continues with a square design theme and a sense of adventure everywhere you look. The Land Cruiser was also cramped with the kind of technology we expect from today's vehicles. This time around, Toyota says the Land Cruiser will start at a more attractive price in the mid $50,000 range and will hit dealerships in spring 2024. 2024 Chevrolet Traverse Chevy has revealed the new 2024 Traverse with an in-your-face design, a more potent powertrain, and an expanded lineup that now includes an off-road Focus Z71 model. The 2024 Traverse's design isn't a huge departure from the outgoing crossover, retaining the boxy profile, high-mounted LED running lights. The cabin has been fully revamped with a clean, cohesive design centered around a new standard 17.7-inch touchscreen. The base LS trim comes standard in 8-passenger configuration, also offered on the LT. The Z71 and top-of-the-line RS are exclusively 7-seaters due to the second-row captain's chairs. Under the hood, the 2024 Traverse ditches the naturally aspirated 3.6-liter V6 for a new turbocharged 2.5-liter 4-cylinder. The inline 4 pumps out a healthy 315 horsepower. The motor links to an 8-speed automatic transmission in place of the old 9-speed unit, and the Traverse comes in either front-wheel or all-wheel drive. Sales of the new model will begin early next year, with production taking place at GM's Lansing Delta Township plant in Michigan. 2024 Lexus GX 550 Lexus has finally updated the GX midsize luxury SUV after 14 long years. It was evident from the time this news broke out that the 2024 GX will be all new from the ground up. This new midsize luxury SUV is bigger than its predecessor, comes with a downsized yet more powerful V6, and adds a new rugged off-road ready GX trim. The three-row interior is now more spacious, more luxurious, and packed with more technology. The redesigned horizontal instrument panel now sits lower for improved visibility. 
four-wheel drive with a low range is standard across the board, as is a center locking differential. The standard powertrain in the GX550 is a twin-turbocharged 3.4-liter V6 engine and a 10-speed automatic transmission. This is the same engine found in the Toyota Tundra, the Toyota Sequoia, and the Lexus LX600. And in the GX550, it produces 349 horsepower and 479 pound-feet of torque. Lexus claims a combined fuel economy rating of 17 mpg, a slight bump over the old V8 GX460's 16 mpg combined, but a more fuel-efficient hybrid model is coming later. That's all for today. If you would like to see the new models already released in 2023, click on the link right up here. If you're new here, please subscribe and give us a thumbs up.